the box. It's been too long since I played uh, Barry Stars, so here I am playing it again. Um, for at least a little bit. But that's more because I've played PlayStation 4 at all. I've been working a bit, and um, I, haven't, I haven't really felt like playing video games. I just get home and I'm tired. And, uh, it's the weekend now. And it's, it's Sunday, I guess, isn't it? I didn't play on Friday. I was tired after work, I guess. And I didn't play yesterday either. But here I am back again with Barry Stars. So I just play a little bit. Get, get, keep myself in the habit, remind myself what's going on in the game. It seems like the story is just moving very slowly at this point. We're identifying identity. <laughs> Communication started. Identifying identity. How, ridic how ridiculous. I'm guessing I was going to talk to Sale next. So let's do that. Um, obviously I don't need the quick save because I just loaded up the quick save. Um, we're ready to just hit R1 and move forward, but I want to talk to everybody first. So let's talk to Sale about from fan to hater. Uh, Esson Young seems emotionally invested with Do-Yoon and Joo Young. They might be a fan of at least one of them. What do you think of that theory, uh, uh, Sale? <laughs> Are you saying they, they could be a former fan? The way I see it, they feel betrayed, either by Ju Young or me. In your opinion, what's the reason? Maybe we didn't meet their expectations or side with them. Staff members are also humans, so of course some of us prefer certain contestants over others. Seems like he's more comfortable talking about the possibility of being a staff member now. Being a fan of someone is a problem matter, so that's that. I wonder if I'll find Sale in this conversation. Sale stopped talking and gave a smirk. I think in this one I'm just going to go through all the conversations with, options with Sale, and then once once that's done, uh, I'm probably going to stop there and um, uh, and uh, what, what am I going to do? I'm gonna stop there and uh, and uh, uh, yeah, that'll be the end of the first video. Uh, I don't know if I'll keep going or not. You're a fool if you're expecting anything anything from a contestant. Could have been mistaken since we see each other every day, but we're from two different worlds to begin with, right? Consider this very moment. We all, we're all buried here to, in here together, but no one gives a crap about me. Oh, damn, that's not true. Say, we like you. You were openly accusing one of the staff of being S. Sung Young. Yeah, but that's, well, yeah, it, it's likely to be you, actually. That's a fair point. I'm just glad you aren't saying that I'm S. Sung Young. Well, we kind of were, but. <laughs> oh, no, of course not. <laughs> Not right now, but I will see. Yeah, let me he's not wrong. If this continues, what would be the end result? Yeah, I mean, you are the most likely staff member. I mean, it's not gonna be... I feel like the, for the game to like have like the most dramatic potential, S. Young Young should be one of the one of the six characters, you know? There were six originally, right? Yeah. One is dead now. I could be S. Young. Huh? That'd be a big surprise. In episode six, the show aired a flashback of Ju Young, and made it look like there was a quarrel between her and Ju Young. It was nothing serious, but it was edited differently. It staged conflict. What do you think about that, um, Sale? They certainly broadcast it that way. Then the edits were made to distort what actually happened. But it did happen though, right? As far as I'm concerned, there had been conflicts before the mission. It wasn't even a conflict, and they quickly... Oh, look at this, he's what a bastard. Beastars isn't a show for just the, the two of them. The show must create rivalries in order to grab people's attention. Those who failed to create issues got eliminated before appearing on the show. 
looking back now, can you say you were unhappy? Cool. The scene where they resolved their issues could be added later, but it wasn't real. The production crew must edit hundreds of hours of footage to try to lure more viewers. And to do that over dozens of episodes, it must present a good story. Come to think of it, that's what Sung Young had said. We all know their efforts. Ah, yeah, you're quoting Sung Young, getting into her mentality. Oh, when he was doing that, he was starting to think as Sung Young earlier. Starting to think from her perspective earlier in the conversations that I had with him. Does that mean he's as Sung Young? I mean, he's an obvious suspect. Except, he can't be. Because in, in the other version of the reality where I lost in the, in the normal ending, he died and Sung Young continued to post afterwards. But it doesn't change the fact that they're, they over-exaggerated and distorted the context. I don't expect you to understand. The editing team gets to decide what they want to portray in each episode. That makes so inevitable about the profile accident. As with everything, there was a lot of controversy re regarding the finalists. And it gave them a good excuse. The profiles got mixed up. A good excuse. People began to suspect that the entire show was being fabricated. They had to show some action and move on before the issue grew bigger. So they needed a scapegoat. Yeah. An excuse to get rid of him. But the guy actually messed up with the profile data. That's a fact. Wasn't he supposed to receive confirmation during the process? He was supposed to according to the process. Jesus, this, this dialogue is weird. But things got often skipped during crunch time. What? Having said that, Sale drooped his head. I never thought I'd be saying these things. I was speaking from Sung Young's point of view without even realizing it. Again. I'd rather stop talking about this. I mean, he's constantly speaking from Sung Young's point of view. Many, belo the Beloved fan, many of the newly hired staff members were fans of Beloved. Some even cheered after meeting Sung Young in person. What do you think about that? Yeah, he was young. He was in school when Beloved was active. Yeah, it must have been amazing for him to see you young in person. Does any other staff member... Does any staff member come to mind? Still frown with after a brief pause. Ugh. I don't do. I can't remember every single one, especially the short-term contract workers. It wasn't even my rule to manage them. But I think Ju Young might remember him. There's nothing I can say regarding that matter. Okay, the official account manager. Big fan of Beloved. Yes, he did. He shouldn't have crossed the line as the official account manager. <laughs> He must have received warnings several times. Krum. Did it work? He, he began to behave, behave himself. Ani. No, he insisted that he had his own way of doing things. He insisted that Fader users enjoyed his style of pretending to be a beloved fan. Things got noisier and he finally began to refrain. I guess people don't really know when to stop. They just don't listen. Okay, let's move on. Many of them wanted to work during vacation as a way of touring the broadcasting company. But I don't remember anyone in particular though. Other than the fact that they were all that they were all clumsy. Was it that bad? They were all newbies. I couldn't expect them to be as efficient as other experienced members. They messed up their tasks unless I was, unless I carefully taught them every single step. 
Some even quit without notice, later asking for their paychecks. They, they, these weren't rare occasions, and that's what happens when you make hurried hiring decisions. Staff members joined their own group chat rooms. Sung Young's death must have been shared via those chat rooms. Like I said, there were just too many of them. For sharing info, making friends, and keeping emergency contacts. More importantly, I have no way of accessing them right now. Right, you don't have a smart device. I'm sure they made an announcement through the messenger, though. I'm just not sure when and which to which level. There are just too many of them. I'll only be able to figure it out after we get out of here. Most young staff members are using it, Fader. Uh, but after several incidents, they were retrained not to use a private Fader account to leak info about the show. Even after complete training, bad things inevitably happen. If Fader is so trendy, you have your account too? Why are you asking? Um, no, I didn't say that. What? Uh, just, just asking out of curiosity. You don't even have a device? Exactly. I am out of contact with everyone right now. I'm solely relying on you guys to, sh to know what's going on, which is extremely frustrating. Sail clenched the strap of his messenger bag. Yeah, there he goes. He's such a liar. You said S. L. Young could be one of the staff members, right? <coughs> At the same time, you're asking me all these vague questions. You know I'm the only staff member around here, right? I don't know. Uh, you're the only one I can ask about the details of the show. So don't be mad at me for asking questions. Then you should filter out some of the, your questions so as not to disturb me. Yeah, it's true. I like... I. If I were playing this game more tactically, I, I, I'm, I'm not just supposed to ask them every question, I guess, probably. But it seems to be working as a strategy that the story moves forward, whereas if I didn't ask any questions, if I only asked only the, only the main questions, it results, in, it results in a game over. So, um, you know, it's, it's um, uh, my sanity dropped to near zero, and I, I um, although I guess that was, was that actually, was that just because I made that one wrong choice? I'm not sure now. But this seems to be working, you know, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick with this. Anyway, we're moving on to Inna. Um, that's the end of this video. I will see y'all next time. Uh, please like and subscribe. Uh, I think I'm gonna take a break now. That, that awful conversation where I lost lots of sanity from sale didn't make me want to keep playing <laughs> somehow. So, um,. Yeah, let's take a little break, uh, but uh, I said please like and subscribe already, didn't I? Um, leave a comment below, and I will see y'all next time with Inha, where we will talk about a specific time frame. What do you think, Inha? Mm. That's when my Stabby character began to gain attention. Is that right? Then. From Super Week up to the finals, did any of the staff members stand out at the time? Stand out at the time. Yes, uh, you don't need to repeat what I'm saying. 